What's up you guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we will be showing how to get GroupMe, uh, the group messaging app slash platform on your Apple Watch. So this is offered by a third party developer and the app is called WristMe. Um, and I wanted to go through it and set it up and kind of show you the process. Uh, and full disclosure, the developer did reach out uh, and asked me to do a kind of review and my impressions. And this is something that I use myself personally, so I, I figured it was something that uh, would make sense for me to do. So let's head over to the App Store. And this is a paid app. I believe it was $1.99. Um, but basically, you can uh, set up your Apple Watch. Let's get rid of this. You can set up your Apple Watch to see your conversations, actually read them. Um, you can kind of see right there that images are also supported, which is pretty cool. Uh, you can send replies from uh, like a conversation via dictation or scribble or this keyboard uh, option that they have. And you can also like and unlike posts or messages. Um, and that's pretty cool. So uh, with that being said, um, you can also see your profile as we saw, but let's actually get into setting up the actual app and kind of going through its features and uh, how it works. So I deleted the app originally. Oh no, a little power. Um, but let's see if we can get this video done before uh, this phone I'm recording with decides to die. So um, I deleted the app and I reinstalled it to show you guys how to set it up from scratch. So we're going to open up Risk Me here. And we're presented with like the screen that talks about like the features and whatnot. And we're gonna hit this button to get the login screen. And respectively, over here, we are going to open up the Wrist Me app, which I have all the way down here. So we'll open this up, it'll give us a little spinner, and it should tell us in like two seconds um, that we need to set it up. And sometimes I've I have had an experience where once you open this, uh, it'll where you go. It'll it'll uh, spin a little longer than what you expect. So if it does, just hit that button, um, and it'll tell you that you still need to sign in. So I'm gonna sign in on here really fast uh, on my iPhone, and I'll be right back. Okay, so we have signed in successfully, and once you sign in, the screen kind of just uh, slides back, and you come down here, and you see no longer um, a sign in button. So on the watch here, we're gonna hit this button to continue and hopefully we see our chats really fast like so. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. So pretty fast and seamless setup. So let's zoom in here for you guys. So over here, of course, you can swipe through your, scroll through your conversations using either the screen or the digital crown, of course. And we can tap into a conversation and you'll notice that it'll load up the messages fairly quick, which I think is pretty cool. You can hit reply down here, and you get these options to reply. Um, and I don't want to reply right now, obviously, because these are actual conversations. So uh, that's pretty cool. You can also force tap, and there are options to uh, either like create a new group, or to see your profile, or you can even sign out on here. Um, we can, of course, refresh on here, which will refresh our conversations if anything is old. And um, I will add, from personal use, this does support cellular, which is pretty cool. Um, so you can actually be out uh, running or something, and you can just take your watch with you. And that's actually why I got this, because me and my buddies use GroupMe quite a bit. Um, but that's basically it. So we can come into here, and we can, of course, um, create a new group. And it gives us uh, some options here, like what we want to call it. And we can use dictation or the keyboard. And let me actually show you guys the keyboard because the keyboard is pretty cool. So if we tap into a conversation here and if we scroll it down, I hit the keyboard. So the first time the keyboard actually pops up, it does uh, in fact load, um, a one-time load. It like loads, I guess, like uh, the words or whatever, but the keyboard is a, like really, really cool to type on. So this is basically how you get GroupMe on your Apple Watch. And I would recommend this. I would give this a solid eight and a half out of 10. Um, I have had some issues with uh, notifications coming in late. Um, oh, and I should also add this, this app does support complications, which is pretty cool. 
But yeah, that about does it. Um, over here you can uh, go in and there are some settings and there is this uh, setup video which you can use to watch um, how to set up the actual app. And uh, of course it supports emojis, um, supports replying, photos, and um, direct chats and group chats. And yeah, that's about it. Um, that is how you get group me on your Apple Watch. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Smash that like button if you enjoyed it. It really helps me out. Um, subscribe for more content in kind of technology, apps, reviews, uh, programming, and leave some comments down below. Um, cool, I'll see you guys in the next video.